Vermitrader are proud to announce our latest feature and that is strategy templates. Now strategy templates is something I'm very, very excited about. It is a way to massively speed up the time it takes you to set up a trade and also to get more consistent with your setups because you're going to be basically copying and pasting them when you want to. So to add a strategy template, you want to add a trigger first because you'll be adding the strategy template onto a trigger, then go to add setup. You will see this new field, which is strategy template. So we're gonna give this one a name. So right now we are looking for a bounce off this uptrend. So we're gonna call this uptrend bounce. And we're gonna save that, confirm new template name. Yes, that is an uptrend bounce. Now what we're gonna to wanna to do is set up our trade and what Vem is gonna do is remember everything we set. So I'm gonna set the direction to long. We are looking for a bounce, funnily enough with a strategy called uptrend bounce. Now I do like to have distance to activate, so I'm gonna set that as 0.05. We are currently down on the one minute, so things are quite small. Uh, distance to confirm, I'm gonna set as a 0.1 because I definitely want to see that bounce. I'm also gonna add an expiry date and move that across to there. And I'm gonna add operate on candle close because that is what I want to see in my uptrend bounce. So what's gonna happen is Vemma is going to remember all those things. Once I save this setup, Vemma's gonna save it as uptrend bounce. But it's not just the conditions that it will save and the direction and the strategy, it will also save aspects of risk management. So if I want to change my account risk, which I'm not going to, but I could save it as 10% or 3% or whatever it might be for this given strategy, I can also save a minimum risk to reward. So I'm gonna set that as 1.5. When it comes to the stop loss and the take profit, we save some parts but not all because we figure that the value and the percentage aren't going to be relevant to every single trade that you set up. They're gonna be different based on what you're looking at. So what we do save is the percentage or value, right, in terms of the setting, not the actual numbers, uh, and the stop loss strategy. So for this, I'm gonna use an other side of trend line stop loss because I want to see a bounce. I wanna have my stop loss below the, uh, below the trend line. When Vemma places this trade, so I'm gonna go for 0.1%. I also want to use the Vemma Smart Stop. Vemma is also going to remember if I have multiple take profits and what the allocations on them were. So I might decide that I want to have a 50, 25, 25 split on this setup. So if I set that up as so, Vemma is going to remember all that. So now we have a setup that I am quite happy with. I've given my strategy template a name, uptrend bound. So all I have to do is add that and submit my trade. When I do that, I'm gonna know that Vemma has now saved that setup and I can check that by going to my account, customization, strategy templates. So here I can see all the templates that I have set up and we can see my new uptrend bounce one. I can delete any of them. I can add a new one straight from here. So you don't actually have to be setting up a trade to create a template. You can add them straight from here or you can just set up a trade as you would normally and then give it a template name. And I can also edit templates I've set up previously. So if I come to my uptrend bounce, you can see all these settings that it has saved. Um, same in the risk management. So if you're ever not sure which settings save and which don't, this is probably the screen to come to because you can see it quite quickly. And I might decide that actually, you know what, I want to put a distance to invalidate on all of these in the future. So I can now add a, let's call that a 0 0.2 distance to invalidate. And now whenever I use this setting, which we'll go and look at now, you will see that then we'll automatically add all those things that I have just done. So if we come back to our uh, start charting screen and we go to trigger, add a new setup. When we click on strategy template, we can actually see all the ones that we have saved. So you can see a few of the ones that I've saved previously. But if I select that uptrend bands, what you'll see is then we'll actually propagate all those settings that we just set up. So now I don't have to select my direction. I don't have to select my strategy. I don't have to add my conditions. All of those will automatically be applied. So really all that's left for me to do is drag my take profits to where I want them to be maybe make some changes. I might decide actually, you know what, I want a 0.5% to invalidate on this one. And for my stop loss, I'm gonna go for a 0.2% 0 0 um, on the other side of trend line. And then all I can do is add that. So you can see how much it speeds up the setup process, right? Once you have saved these templates, it is so, so fast to set up a similar trade again in the future.